afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and a very warm welcome to Micklefield Hall and to the wedding ceremony of Mike and Dominique. On behalf of Mike and Dominique, I would like to thank all of you for being here to celebrate the beginning of a new chapter in their lives. I know it means a great deal to them that you could all be here to share in their happiness and to witness this important and special occasion. For Mike and Dominique, getting married here today is a confirmation of the love, respect and friendship that they have for each other. Together they have found happiness and fulfilment and it is in this spirit that they have chosen to affirm their relationship in this formal and public pledge. If any person present knows of any lawful impediment to this marriage, they must declare it now. <laughs> Don't look round, it encourages people. <laughs> I declare that I know of no legal reason I know of not no legal reason why I, Michael Demetrius Evangelou why I, Michael Demetrius Evangelou may not be joined in marriage may not be joined in marriage to Dominique Therese Abbas to Dominique Therese Abbas and now Dominic, if you repeat these words after me I declare that I declare that I know of no legal reason I know that for no legal reason. Why I, Dominique Therese Abbas. Why I, Dominique Therese Abbas. Why I, Dominique Therese Abbas. 
may not be joined may not be joined in marriage to in marriage to Michael Demetrius Michael Demetrius eventually <laughs>Michael Demetrius Evangelou. Take you, Dominique Therese Abbas. Take you, Dominique Therese Abbas. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. I, Dominique Therese Abbas. Take you, Michael Demetrius Evangelou. Take you, Michael Demetrius Evangelou. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. Right. Mike, do you promise to love, honour and respect Dominique? Be her companion in life, best friend and soulmate, and support and care for Dominique for as long as you both shall live. Uh, I do. Dominique, do you promise to love, honour and respect Mike? Be his companion in life, best friend and soulmate, and support and care for Mike for as long as you both shall live. I do. Uh, I give you this ring as a symbol of our marriage as a symbol of our marriage may it always remind us of today may it always remind us of today and be a sign of our love and commitment and be a sign of our love and commitment As a symbol of our marriage as a symbol of our marriage may it always remind us of today May it always remind us of today and be a sign and be a, a sign of our love and commitment of our love and commitment I vow to always be open and honest with you to be patient and kind and listen with an open heart especially when Arsenal on TV. Reasons why I love you. You have seen me at my worst, yet you still love me. You know how to cheer me up and make me laugh. I can trust you with anything. You are always there for me. I love you because you are my person, my best friend and my partner in crime. I love you because you are my everything. I can't wait to see the future has in store for us. I love you so much. So today is a new beginning for you both. May you have many happy years together, and in those years may all of your hopes and dreams be fulfilled. Above all, may you always believe in each other, and may the warmth of your love enrich not only your lives, but the lives of all those around you. Mike and Dominic, it now gives me great pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife, and you may kiss.
I'm so glad you found someone who supports you, treats you right, and who swears as much as you. <laughs> Together, you'll be an annoyingly unsupportable force. Um, so anyway, what I was trying to say in a really long way is it was always just Dominique, Mum and me against the world and now there's four of us and I'd like to welcome Mike and his testosterone to our family <laughs> of strong, independent women. <laughs> I, wouldn't, I wouldn't change anything for the memories I've got with Mike. We've done everything together and I loved every minute of it, even though he nearly got us beaten up and chased by wild dogs and everything else. I wouldn't change it for the world. But on a serious note, I'm honoured to be standing here up with you on your wedding day as your best man watching you marry this beautiful woman and the love of your life. So ladies and gents, please join me in raising the glass to you, Mike, and your lovely wife, Dominique. Today, I stand in front of you as a very happy man. When I look at my lovely wife, I'm filled with so much joy and gratefulness. She completes me in every way and has brought so much happiness into my life. I want to take this moment to thank her for being the most amazing person and for always being there for me. I love you more than words can ever express. I love you, Mrs. Evangelou. So a toast to Dominique for ruining her life for me. <laughs> She's beautiful. It's no secret you were dealt a bad card at the start of your life. So when people talk about fighters in life, I always turn to you. You're fearless, kind, always put me first. Thank you so much for that. I don't know what I would do without you. You calm me down when I'm at my worst and you bring me happiness when I think the world can't get any more harder for us. Dominique, my promise to you is that I'll always protect you, fight for you and support you for the rest of your life. You're my world and I love you for being you. It's us against the world and I've always said that. So ladies and gentlemen, thank you again from the bottom of our hearts. Please stand for the one and final toast to the beautiful, amazing Dominique Evangelou. Yeah!